Karen, uh, just your reaction when you heard about Araldus' uh, coronavirus test, and is there any concern because he, he was with you guys? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's definitely, you know, um, you know, tough, especially when it comes to a teammate of yours that just tests positive. Um, but, you know, it just proves how safe we got to be within our, within our uh, little bubble that we're in right now and um, continue to make sure that everybody's doing what they need to do to, uh, to stay, you know, negative. And, uh, you know, hopefully he recovered from it fast and, um, you know, gets back to the team. Did you have to go undergo any additional testing because of his test? No, no, no. We ended up having a test, I think, that day. So, um, and then we all took it. I think we have another one today. Um, so, uh, and I, think, I believe everybody came back negative besides Chappie. So, it's good. Thank you, Mark. Take the next question from Sweeney Murdy. Sweeney, go ahead and unmute. Sweeney, you got to unmute, man. <laughs> Come on, Sweeney. Let's Come go. on, dog. Sorry, bro. Computer you got stuff acting, to do. Computer's acting slow. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's user error also. Yeah. <laughs> hey, um, Aaron, can you tell us a little bit about what your routine has been this maybe this last week away mm-hmm. from the ballpark? Like you said, yeah, it just proves even more now how safe you have to be. What have you been doing when you're not there and how careful have you had to be? Uh, I mean, for me, I just kind of just go home, go home and, um, watch TV, you know, continue to be back into the quarantine kind of, uh, lifestyle. Um, you know, just like everyone else, just kind of, um, the most I probably do is probably go to get groceries and stuff like that. But, um, you know, majority of the time I'm just going straight home and getting right back into, uh, the quarantine lifestyle. Take the next question mm-hmm. from Brendan Cuddy. Brendan, go ahead. Thanks, Z. Aaron, thanks for taking the time. Mm-hmm. Could you tell us the immediate reaction in the clubhouse when you guys found out that Chapman tested positive? Were you guys uh, shocked, freaked out? Uh, I mean, it's, it's, it's kind of hard to say, um, you know, that – that we knew that or or we expected to go throughout the whole season without anybody getting, you know, tested positive. I think that would be uh, remarkable, I think. Um, but, the, I mean, it's just a part of what's what's going on right now. You know, it, it, you can get uh, the COVID at, at any time, you know, just kind of um, going throughout your daily, you know, um, routine. You can get it, uh, you know, it's just something that's just kind of unpredictable and you can't see it. So, um you know, it just makes it tough, you know, but I feel like everybody was pretty understanding that, you know, it's, it's, it's not anybody's fault, you know, it just kind of happens and, um, you know, just we're, we're doing everything we can to be safe and it, it still kind of happened. And personally, do you go through a mental checklist? Do you say, oh man, was I around all this? Was I playing catch with them? Did I have my arm? Like, did, does that go through your head? Uh, definitely. I mean, you know, um, we still communicate with each other, you know, uh, uh, just like normal, except we have masks on and, um, you know, we, we have gloves on and stuff like that. So, um, of course you're going to automatically go, go run it back through your head. Was I ever near this guy or, or this or that? And so, um, but yeah, you definitely do that for sure. Mm-hmm. Uh, Meredith, you can go ahead and unmute. You have the next question. Aaron, you had Buster Posey opt out the other day. Other big name players have opted out. Now you have a teammate that's tested positive that had been at the ballpark. Is there any part of you that doubts that this season might not get underway or doubts that the season will even get underway? Um, mm, no, not really. I mean, I feel like um, I'm going to prepare for, for my team you know, uh, to, to get ready for this season. So um, the only way that we are going to not play the season is if, you know, a lot more teams are not trying to play. But uh, I feel like my team is prepared um, 
to to play this year and and we're motivated to to play this year so um obviously we haven't had anybody say that they don't want to play um i believe so so um you know i just feel like we're we're putting ourselves in position to get ready for the season thanks we'll take a last one from brian hoke brian go ahead and unmute Hey, Aaron. Um, you spoke a few minutes ago about being back in that quarantine lifestyle. Um, I was just wondering, how do you think guys are going to deal with that when the regular season starts, especially when the team is traveling? Uh, I mean, probably just a whole bunch of video games and uh, <laughs> TV watching, you know, TV binge watching, stuff like that. Uh, um, it's kind of what I, I would assume that's what, you know, that's definitely what I'm going to be doing. So. Um, probably just start from there and then, um, you know, uh, try the best they can to, uh, to stay safe. I would assume so. Do you think the guys can handle that? I guess is my question. Yeah. All our, all our team does is play <laughs> video games for sure. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'm not too worried about my team and, uh, you know, going out and getting wild because, <laughs> uh, they like their video games. 